Um, hi guys, it's Evan from Evster Casting, and today I'm going to be bringing you another mod tutorial on how to install Zeppelin Mod 1.4.2. Um, as usual, it hasn't really properly come out, but I'm going to tell you how to get it again. So, let's start, you go into your web browser. Uh, first link in the description is the installer for 1.2.5. This mod hasn't been updated for a while, so you go into your exe folder there. You download that. Um, next thing you want to do is go to MC Nostalgia and find your download link, which is there. I'll have all links are in the description. Um, and last of all, this mod doesn't really work properly without um, too many items, so you want to find this link and then come down here where it says download here. And I have to wait for AdFly, which is a bit annoying. And then you just press skip and it should start your download. And that's pretty much done. So go find your downloads folder and you'll have all your things in there. You're still partially downloading. But all you want to do is you get your Zeppelin mod and your too many items and drag it to the desktop. Um, that's the first thing you want to do. Then you want to make a new folder for your MC Nostalgia. Oh, it's gone down there. Um, I'm not going to name it for now. Um, just open that up. You want to open up your MC Nostalgia. Drag it to the side. And what you want to do here is you want to basically drag all that into there. And then you're done with that. So you can X out all of this. Okay, so then you want to go into your folder, whatever you've called it, and open up MC Nostalgia. Um, first of all, before you do this, you want to make sure that you have your fresh Minecraft updated to 1.4.2. Otherwise, it's probably not going to work. So when it's updated, um, you come back on here, press Enter, and it will load up all your versions you can go to. For this mod, you are going to need 1.2.5, which all the numbers are down here and all the um, what versions it is there. So it's 1.91 for 1.2.5. Scroll back down again, type that number in. So 91. And it will start installing itself. This does take a little while, it doesn't take too long, but you just have to be a bit patient. Um, it will tell you if it's worked and if it's not, um, if you've got successful, etc., that means it's probably worked. So press enter and you're done with that part. Now, the next part you want to do is you want to do it in the same order as me. You want to go to the mod installer to run it. Um, and then you want to just press install mod. You can back your Minecraft up if you want. Um, I'm not going to bother. Um, make sure you do this before the um, too many items though. Because if you do the too many items before, when you install this mod, it kind of deletes all of the um, folders with the too many items in. So that should have worked. So then what you want to do is you want to go find it, um, your Minecraft folder. And you want to go to dot .minecraft bin find your minecraft or your jar whatever it's called open with WinRAR archiver and then you'll know if the mod is installed properly because it will have no meter inf should be in capitals you'll see it quite clearly I do not have it here if you see that you have to install the mod again with the mod installer um, you know if it's worked properly um, and you've got it all running uh, you want to open up your too many items and you want to drag that all of it into your minecraft.jar and just let that do that and that's basically it so just open up your minecraft and I'll just show you quickly how you know it's what if it's worked you should see too many items which is a good sign should load up fine and have 1.2.5 here um, you want to turn it into creative just in case it hasn't worked too many items part load it up and you should see now oh, see. and we know it's worked because we got it here but just to prove that you want to see here you've got airship controller, elevator controller, ship controller etc and a compass block and um, when you get all that you know your mod has worked and that is all from me, so I hope you found this useful, and if you have, please um, comment, like, and subscribe if you want. Um, and that's it from me today, guys, so see ya, and bye.